guys, welcome back to my channel and for today's video is another travel vlog and we'll be heading to Melbourne, Australia. dito na lang daw kami magpapalit ng pera sa Pilipinas kasi mas malaki daw yung palitan dito sa Pilipinas. Ayan na ang board. Papaganda pa. Hindi mo makikita yung forever mo dito. <laughs> Hindi namin ina-expect kasi November ngayon. Nakala namin summer. So yung mga dala kong damit maninipes. May mga dala lang ako mga konting jacket. Hi! Hey, welcome! Welcome to us! <laughs> kailangan namin malaman dito sa Australia. Okay, ang muna muna is the password ng Wi-Fi. Okay, tapos? At ang second thing naman is lahat ng tubig sa faucet is portable. Wow! Yes. And then, the third one is ang ating saksakan ay nakaibang sa saksakan. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Patingin. So, pag bubot na kayo dito, kailangan may universal socket. Kasi, ganito ang socket dito. Yan, magdala kayo guys kung ayaw nyo malobat. So, this is our room. Thank you, Ate Joy, for letting us stay here. Good morning! What a beautiful day of Ingay! What a beautiful day here in Melbourne! So, ito yung suburb nila dito. And, ang kikit ng mga house. And, magtataka ka. Ganda ng house. Pero, yung pundasyon yan, kahoy lang. Nakikita ko sa inyo mamaya. Ayan. Kahoy lang, guys, yung pundasyon! <laughs> sa Central Business District or CBD na tinatawag. So, ang CBD, yun ang pinaka-city nila dito sa Melbourne. And, ang una natin i-visit ay ang Victoria State Library and Victoria Gallery. Nakita niyo yung Operator 25 na restaurant and isa siya sa pinakamagandang brunch cafe dito sa Melbourne. And sabi nila, pag pumunta ka ng Melbourne, kailangan mo ma-experience yung mga brunch cafes nila. And kami, kahit gusto na gusto namin kumain doon, hindi na kaya ng time. So, 20 minutes na lang, walking tour na namin. So, nandito kami ngayon sa 7-Eleven and dahil gutom na gutom na kami, wala na kaming time para kumain sa restaurant. Dadali na lang namin yung mga pagkain na to sa walking tour namin later. 
So guys, yung coffee dito may $1 tapos may $2. Mas mura pa yung coffee kesa sa water. Kasi yung water dito is, kano nga? Ayan, $3. So mas maganda kung magbao na kayo agad ng water. So guys, sila yung mga nag... Uh, offer ng free tour dito sa Melbourne and ito yung local guide to Melbourne. Ayan, I'm free yung pangalan. And dito yung meeting place. Ayan, dito yung meeting place dito sa Victoria State Library. And may oras siya. Ano oras nga? 10.30 a.m. and 2.30 p.m. every day. Uh, so, libre siya. Libre siya. Pero, syempre, magbibigay ka ng tip dun sa mga guide kung magugustuhan mo yung trip. I need you all to come in much closer. Take about three more steps this way. That is the old Melbourne jail. Now, if you look just up there, you'll see three figure eights. They are there to represent the eight hours of work, eight hours of rest, and eight hours of play. Everyone, uh, in the Gold Rush, there was a lot of immigration from all different parts of the world. There was a huge amount of immigration from the south of China. And uh, before heading up to the northern gold fields, this area of the city is where a lot of those South Chinese immigrants used to gather. And this is what we're going to see down here in Melbourne's China. So, enjoy mo naman. Nakainin. Yes. Nakaka-enjoy siya, pero nakakapagod kasi ang bilis nila maglakad, bash! <laughs> Dalawang stride. Dalawang stride Kailangan namin stride yung isang stride na. nila kasi ang haba ng mga binti. So, dito sa second part ng tour na to, tour namin, more on ano na daw siya. Kung susimula, yung first half, more on sa history. Dito sa second half, pupuntahan na natin yung mga, ano yung wall art ba tawag niya? Street, ah, street art, sorry. have applied for permits from the government to have their walls legally painted off. Street station. The trains in here have been operating since the 1860s. Uh, from here, you have a great view of our lovely city. And you can really see the great diversity of architecture throughout the city of Melbourne just here. But as well as that, you can see our beautiful, uh, sort of beautiful, Yarra River. So guys, that's it for our walking tour. And yung mga pinakita ko sa inyong mga clips ay some of the places lang na pinuntahan namin. Kasi hindi ko na na-vlog lahat kasi sobrang dami nung pinuntahan namin. So umabot yung tour ng two and a half hours. And sobrang sulit kasi ang daming napuntahan, malalaman mo talaga kung saan pwede kang kumain, yung mga streets, kung saan pwede pumarty, and yung history talaga ng Melbourne. I would like to explain to you the tram system dito sa Melbourne. And yung tram dito, libre lang, walang bayad, basta within the CBD area lang. Pero once na lumabas na yung tram sa CBD area, May bayad na siya automatic siyang ikakaltas sa Mikey card mo. Yung Mikey card, pwede kayong pumili sa 7-Eleven worth $6. Pero, para mas makamura kayo, mag-download na lang kayo ng Mikey card sa Android phone nyo para makatipid kayo ng $6. Kasi, kailangan nyo pang loadan yun. Guys, we are already here at Brighton Beach and kung hindi lang malamig, pwede kayong mag-swimming sa beach. Pero ngayon, ang gagawin lang namin, magpipicture kami dito sa Instagram worthy ng mga houses na to. We are now on our last stop for today which is the St. Gilda and sana makakita kami ng penguins ngayon and before kami pumunta dun sa site na madaming penguins mag ikot, -ikot muna kami dito kasi ang ganda ng lugar look guys so oh, dun yung beach and pwede kayong kumain sa mga restaurants may mga restaurants doon so guys di ko pala nasabi sa inyo kanong oras na it's 7.45 p.m. Pero maliwanag pa din. Ganito daw dito, matagal daw ang sunset. And sabi sa weather app, ang sunset daw ngayon is 8.30.
just in time para makita natin yung mga penguins kasi usually lumalabas sila pagka sunset na. Oh. <laughs> Everybody, could you everyone just step back two or three meters away from the penguin, please? Okay. okay. Uh, Look at how many people are waiting on the penguin. So what? Oh, 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 so guys, and dito kami ngayon sa isang pastry shop dito mismo malapit sa Saint Kilda. Ang naisip namin gawin is bumili kami ng dessert dito sa pastry shop na to. Iuwi na lang namin sa bahay kasi nagluto ng dinner yung friend namin. So that's it guys for our adventures for today. And please keep on watching the vlog if you want to know more about our itinerary for tomorrow. Good morning everyone! Welcome back to another day here in Melbourne, Australia. And we are heading to... Ballarat, Ballarat Wildlife, Wildlife Park. Park. So guys, uh, pag kayo sa Ballarat, pwede kayong sumakay ng train at ilalagay ka sa description box below kung paano pumunta doon via train. Pero pwede rin kayo sumakay sa mga ganitong taxi. Pero kailangan nyo muna mag-download ng app called Didi. Didi app yung parang Uber nila dito. And ang pambayad dito hindi cash, kundi credit card or debit card. So much better if may dala kayong credit card or debit card para makapag-book kayo. And nagkaroon din to ng parang pagkabagong first ride mo, meron ka makukuha ng mga discounts. Let us give them Melbourne you want. And there is like, still they got the old mine, they will take you on the Colleen, you're home! This is your home! <laughs> We're now here at Ballarat Wildlife Park and it's very cold. It's 8 degrees right now. So, ito yung admission prices nila for adult, $35. Child, $19. Family 95. So guys, we're here to feed the kangaroos then. So, the kangaroo food is only $4. And ganito na siya kadami. So guys, pagdating na kami dito, sinalubong kami agad. Ay, may gulat ako. Hi, kangaroo! Hi, kangaroo! Don't, don't, don't. Natatakot ako. Okay, let me feed you. So, Hi! Oh. So guys, bigla dumami yung tao. <laughs> and ito palang mga kangaroo na to. It's just to welcome you pagdating mo. Kasi meron pa palang mga kangaroos doon. Mas madami pa daw. Hundreds of kangaroos. Ay, mag ikot ikot na kami. Titignan na namin yung ibang mga animals dito. So this is Lily. Hi, Lily. <laughs> okay. But yeah, if you'd like a pat, it's yes. on this side there. So guys, ang maganda dito sa zoo na to is yung close encounters nyo sa mga animals. Not like dun sa ibang zoos na pupuntahan natin na nakakulong lang yung mga hayop. Pero dito talagang mahawakan mo sila. Wombat. Alpaca. There's one under the water. Whoa. Whoa. Take my hand. <laughs> so we are now done with our tour and ngayon na dito kami ulit sa cafe because we're going to eat our lunch. We just ordered some hot choco for $4.50 and $7 for this chips and gravy. 
So guys, andito na tayo sa Ballarat Station pero unfortunately wala daw train ngayon. Ang sinadya sa amin dito is sumakay na lang kami ng bus. So sasakay kami ng bus ngayon papunta sa Southern Cross. So guys, ito pala yung reason kung ba't kami pwede sumakay ng train ngayon kasi under construction ang train nila dito ngayon. Sabihin mo nga, Colleen, mag-rent na lang sila ng car. Yes, mas mura ako mag-rent ng car. Kung malakas talaga yung loob nyo, pwede kayong mag-rent ng car. Pero nga lang, nakakatakot. Kasi syempre, hindi tayo sanay na nasa right yung driver seat. $30 lang guys per day ang rent ng car dito. So guys, we are already here. Una namin pinuntahan is yung shopping mall dito which is DFO. So magsa-shopping muna kami. on sale, it's 50% off. So, lahat ng mga branded bags dito, hindi lang Kate Spade, Coach, MK, uh, lahat 50% off. So, I think I would buy this bag. Hi, pagod! <laughs> so, yung malls dito is ingat! Ang ingay niya! Malls dito is hanggang 6pm lang. And, magsa 6 na and nakapag-shopping naman kami ng konti. And, ang kakatawa kasi ang mumura ng mga sapatos kasi nandito yung mga outlet ng mga shoes and yung mga bags and mga branded and signature items ay naka-sale. Yung kapatid kong na-injured. <laughs> Kaya mo pa? How was it? Mahal. Mahal? So, lasang mahal. Lasang mahal din. Ibig sabihin, masarap. How about you? Kung naaalala nyo, nandito kami kahapon doon sa city tour or walking tour. So, bumalik kami dito para itry yung mga coffee nila. So, dito, sabi ng tour guide namin kahapon, wag na wag nyo daw ito try yung Starbucks dito kasi much better itong ma-experience nyo or matlasahan nyo yung local coffee dito sa Melbourne. So, this is my coffee. It's chai latte. And, ano tawag sa coffee mo? Hot chocolate. <laughs> Napaka-unique. Hot chocolate. <laughs> So guys, we enjoy na namin yung coffee na na order namin, and I think this will be the end of today's adventure. And after this, we're going to head home. And tomorrow will be the highlight of our tour here in Melbourne because we will be going to the Great Ocean Road. Good morning, everyone. Good morning, Colleen. Good morning, Good morning, Ate Jo. Good morning. <laughs> so today we are heading to the Great Ocean Road and I'm so excited! So guys, kung gusto nyo pumunta sa Great Ocean Road, pwede kayo mag-rent ng car and pwede rin kayo mag-join sa mga group tours. So meron ditong parang kluk nila and I will put down the link on the description box para ma-check nyo. I think less than 2,000 pesos lang per head tour na yun one day, one whole day to Great Ocean Road. Our friend will drive us there, so we're so lucky. Wanna fish? 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 Wan
Ito mga pwede po. Ang bilis nga naman ano, ng metro eh. Ang bilis nga naman ng metro So guys, uh, pag may nakikita kaming magagandang sceneries, bumababa kami ng sasakyan and nagtitake kami ng photos. That's the art! Guys, kaya ito tinawag na the art because of that rock formation. Stop London Bridge! So guys, dati yung London Bridge na yan, magkadugtong yung dalawang bato na yan. Kaso, ang nangyari, naputol yung uh, tulay. So guys, we are here at Port Campbell Bay. And look at the view. And we're going to have our lunch here and nagpack ng lunch si Ate Joy for us. Sobrang ganda ng view guys. It's parang pinareserve namin to. Oh. Public park, libre lang. Pwede ka pumayas sa ilalim ng puno. Katabi mo yung beach. Guys, I'm going to try Vegemite. The Vegemite is a shang uh, para palaman sa tinapay. Dito lang makikita sa Australia. Damihan pa mo ra? Bulin mo yan. <laughs> so guys, pagkatapos namin kumain, dumiretso na kami dito sa Port Campbell. Yung pinaka-port mismo dito sa Port Campbell. We're here at Lockhart, pero ang daming tao. Expectation versus reality. Hindi <laughs> ka na tayo ngayon sa Twelve Apostles and ito yung pinakasikat talaga sa Great Ocean Road. Snake. Snake. That's a snake. Venomous snake. Oh my god. So guys, we are already here at Kenneth River and dito makakakita tayo ng mga wild animals and mostly mga parrots and pwede daw pakainin yung mga parrots dito and meron din yatang koala ah bawal pala pakainin <laughs> bawal pala pakainin yung mga parrot so guys nagtanong kami dito sa mga campers na nagka-camp dito Sabi nila may mga koalas daw sa mga eucalyptus trees dito. So magtingin-tingin lang daw kami. But unfortunately, up until na wala pa rin kami makita ang koala. So guys, nandito tayo ngayon sa Great Ocean Road Memorial Arc. So ayan siya kung nababasa niyo ang nakalagay, Great Ocean Road. So guys, that's it for our Great Ocean Road experience. And ang masasabi ko lang, sobrang ganda. Super worth it yung sobrang tagal na biyan. Good morning! Another day and our last day here in Melbourne. And we are going to Queen Victoria Market. So guys, we are already here at Queen Victoria Market. So guys, madami dito mga souvenirs na mura kasi talaga mahal dito sa Melbourne. Pero dito sa Queen Victoria Market, mura siya.
Kailangan kayo laging may dalang eco bag. Walang plastic dito so magdala kayo ng eco bag. So, ito yung napili namin na Red Magnet. Six for ten dollars. brunch cafe. If naalala niyo yung pinuntahan namin no first day namin dito which is yung Operator 25. Pupuntahan namin ngayon and makain kami ng brunch. Sakay kami ng tram papunta sa Kosher Lane. Yung makikita natin doon is yung mga street arts and dahil medyo malayo siya sasakay na lang kami ng tram So, Team Sam's here is only uh, $2.5. So, two for five. Ang mura, guys. Siyempre, pasalubong natin yan. So, guys, ang swerte namin kasi Black Friday tomorrow. So, usually, yung mga stores dito, nagkakaroon na sila ng mga discounts and mga sales. Wait. Kapag Plus. So guys, I saved eleven dollars and fifty cents. And lahat talaga na mabibilan dito. Wala silang plastic bags or paper bags. So you have to buy another eco bag. Or much better if you will bring your own eco bag. Hi. Uh, one order of Indian Super Fudge Chunks. Okay. Yep. One. Do you want in a can? Yeah, in a can. In a curl. <laughs> like a R. <laughs> so, dito kayo makakakita ng mga street art. And very perfect for Instagram. <laughs> So guys, I think that's it for my vlog and right now, paupunta na kami sa train station kasi uwi na kami ng bahay and mag na kami ng gamit because we will be heading to the airport later at 9pm. So, everything that you'll need to know is right there on the description box and if you have any questions, feel free to comment down below. So, please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and hit the like button if you like this video. Sana nakatulong to para sa next Melbourne Adventures ninyo. So, bye guys! See you on the next vlog!